our industry icon this year will be the one and only Hideo Kojima. He's here this year. And that's going to be an amazing moment. We are so excited to pay tribute to Mr. Kojima. Uh, and he's joining us here. Hopefully, he's in the front row. Is he there? Mr. Kojima, are you here? Ew, scooter. Would I hit the board? Kojima, are you here? Hi. Put your feet. Put your feet. Mr. Hideo Kojima. Check one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't hear it at all. Play the game. Play the game. I don't hear it at all. Play the to the Game Awards 2016 to celebrate video games, the best form of entertainment out there. Here are the nominees for Best Performance. Best Performance. Nobody likes a bigot unless Unless he's crying, boo-hoo, like a big fucking baby, boo-hoo, when he's crying. You could encounter other players. The reality is, the likelihood of that is tiny, basically. It's just so huge that you're probably not gonna bump into anyone. You can. And we found this new site called CSGO Lotto, so I'll link it down in the description if you guys wanna check it out. But we were betting on it today, and I won a pot of like $69 or something like that. What's breaking news now is that myself and a few other people, including Tom or Pro Syndicate, own CSGO Lotto. And the game award goes to Nolan North. right here who were rescued by no other than Shix Hydrobot. <laughs> Hydrobot gave them a fast pass to the front of the stage. Great work, Hydrobot. Can I? Wow. On top of all that, Shik actually teamed up with Mortal Kombat co-creator John Tobias to bring us a monumental battle that shows us just how unstoppable Hydrobot truly is. Hey. Hydrobot, taking it to the next level, that was sick. You think you can go for a few more rounds? We'll see in a little bit, but for now, let's head back to the Game Awards. That little smile he has? That is years of training. Whenever I was in doubt, what kept me going was a belief that we had to be back on the same stage as last year to give one man a moment he was robbed of. Of course, I am talking about Conan O'Brien. Oh, hello, Game Awards. Let's face it, when you think young and cutting edge, you think Conan O'Brien. Hello, Wrigley 444? And the winner is... Final Fantasy XV. Doom! I'm also happy to announce this year's winner for best music and sound design. That goes to Doom. Hey, 
And now it's time to announce a brand new game and a brand new studio. I'm here with Jesse to uh, tell us about your new studio, your new project. So yeah, we're, we're making a free-to-play PC game. Wow. Wow. Said I wanted to build a statue that really told the story of the evolution of games. Here's your first look at Mass Effect Andromeda gameplay. Just point me to where you're holding him and there won't be any trouble. There won't be. Drop it now. You first. Get out. Lapierre, welcome to the Assassin's Creed Red Room, brought to you by AMD Radeon and Alienware. Let's get this party started. Here is the first exclusive look at Assassin's Creed, the movie, in theaters this December 21st. Tonight's Game Awards is the first ever award show broadcast in VR, thanks to Next VR. Because I love VR, I had to try it myself. Let's do it. Oh, whoa. Oh, this is so real. Oh my God, I feel like I got the best seat in the house. Whoa, Cliff Blazinski. Too real. I'm so happy to have uh, you guys here to talk about Warframe. When you jump in, people are surprised how many people are there and the love they have for this game. Yeah, I mean, we have 26 million registered uh, users, which is crazy to say out loud. The best mobile and handheld game and also wins the best family game, Pokemon Go. We're grateful that we've been given the opportunity to inspire so many people to get off the couch and head outside to explore the world around them and learn more about the communities along the way. Look at me, just a lazy Pokemon player. I'm a fucking black beetle cream in a rocket giant linen like to see him spread eagle took a This thing is so heavy, incredible. by the way. It's incredible. Bicep curls. That dragon, dragon cancer. I know you've got a little news tonight and some new stuff to share about the game. So tell us, what, what, what's new on Lawbreakers? Well, so what we're showing tonight is a new 60-second trailer. And in this trailer, there's a new map known as Vertigo. It's a task gravity modification training facility. All right, thanks, Cliff. And my boy, Pat Varapa, the rapper. Picture this, I'm a bag of dicks. Put me to your lips. I am sick. I will punch a baby bear. Take a shit, little or the way the early morning sunlight dapples through the branches of something ancient, like a tree or <laughs> Nolan. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's ancient. Yeah. Who, who is that? You. Mm. Troy, Troy Bay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's great. Inside! <laughs> Inside also wins Best Independent Game. Thank you, friends. You make a development team in Copenhagen very happy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our industry icon, Mr. Hideo Kojima. Hideo is rebuilding his life and his studio with our support. He is one of the most principled, loyal, and ethical men I have ever met. And I'm just so honored to call you a friend above everything else, Hideo. You've always been there for me, and you have never disappointed me. I love you, Jeff. Blizzard for Overwatch. We love our Twitch audience. Keep them out for Harambe, always. Um, that's right. 
Uh, and we're excited to have with us now Tim Miller, the director of Deadpool. Now, you just got to check out the experience. What did you think? It was pretty exciting. Why are you yelling? You're very excited about this project. It's yeah. like we're in a wind tunnel here, isn't it? I get paid to be excited, Tim, okay? Excited. I don't work for free. I am barely giving the fuck away. Outspoken, unchained, passionate. These gamers stream right into our houses and remind us of what it's like to play with our friends. Trending Gamer, presented by Intel. I have seven dollars because you click on this and you fucking pocketed it. This is the only fucking shit you people care about. You don't care about people reviewing your shit and improving your shit. No, you care about this shit. That's all the shit you fucking. And the care trending about. gamer, the game award goes to Boogie Twenty Nine Eighty Eight. If you look at me, like, physically, there's not a lot I can do in this world, but the game creators like yours have, have, have created worlds that I can explore, worlds that I can accomplish, worlds that I can be a hero in. And I, I think it's so important for nights like tonight to celebrate the people who create those games that have given us a distraction from the world we live in today, that have given me a distraction at the darkest points of my life. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I mean, the people that make these games, at the end of the day, you're the hero, right? Who are you talking to right now? Who is it you think you see? Do you know how much I make a year? I mean, even if I told you, you wouldn't believe it. No, you clearly don't know who you're talking to, so let me clue you in. I am the danger. I am the one who knocks. All right, what an amazing moment. Well, that right there is why we do the show, folks. Um, wow. Hydrobot at it again. Enjoy the rest of the Game Awards, everyone. We gotta go. Hydrobot is gonna school me on how to protect my skin from irritation. Uh, I, I'm here to announce Gearbox Publishing. We're gonna help independent developers uh, bring their games to the world through right. publishing games. And uh, I want to announce our first published title. Uh, this is Sebastian from People Can Fly. Hello, Sebastian. Hi. We know you guys, Painkiller, Gears of War Judgment. Uh, what are you cooking up with Randy? So I'm here to announce Bulletstorm Full Clip. Uh, uh, full Clip. Yes. Um, and 60 FPS. We want all the profit. And it's discounted right now, so go take advantage of that. When a replica Mark V tank from Battlefield 1 well, here it is in the flesh, and it's a little bigger than I expected, but this tank, there's a twist, it comes complete with a Radeon PC inside. Battlefield, play best on AMD. PlayStation Store, you won't believe what's in store. Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. Uh, want to announce that the best fighting game uh, is won by Street Fighter V. And the Game Award goes to... Dishonored 2. Hydrobot, taking it to the next level, that was sick. I'm supposed to dance. Yeah, so, go, go for it. Yeah, okay. So, uh, Arcane is, uh, has been around for 17 years, uh, believe it or not. Uh, so, this is like the result of 17 years of uh, creating the best team uh, that we could. And uh, we're. <laughs> it's uh, an it's honor, it's, uh, it's amazing. Um, At E3 this year, we devoted our entire booth to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So let's take a look. Why is this a game? <laughs> I, I don't know.
don't know, but that's what you're supposed to do. Get out. So this is where I struggle with RPGs, because it's a lot of just walking around, talking to folks. Can I buy a potion? Do I, I have any have, money? Do I have any have credits? Money. I got no credits. This is, we're trapped in a, a Beckett play. There's nothing, <laughs> there's nothing that's going to happen. We're waiting for things that can't happen. Oh, there's going to be some kind of beast, right? Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at that what? thing. What the f is this? Wow. It's a really impressive beast. Could have started the game with this thing. <laughs> Doing this for a bit. I'm going to be over here. <laughs> Just facing the corner. Tell me when something happens. Was that it? That was the battle? What? Did something happen? That's it. I don't when really you, when, feel you, a, when you actually <laughs> feel a sense of accomplishment. That was just to, to suss him out. Why would someone play this? Why would someone play this game? Here are the nominees for Game of the Year. Game of the Year. Here it is. The game of the year at the Game Awards 2016 is... I've got you in my sights. Overwatch. This game and the world that we're building has a message, and it's a message about heroism. It's a message about diversity. It's a message about a bright and positive and hopeful future. And these are all things that we really believe everyone needs a little bit of right now. And uh, keep them out for Harambe, always. Have a great holiday season, great new year. We'll see you in 2017. Good night. Level. That was sick. You think you can go for a few more rounds? <laughs>